Hi again, this is Mark Horton and we're looking about European Interparties Patent Review, otherwise known as Opposition Before the European Patent Office. We've looked at the whole process and in the last video we looked at the receipt of the summons. The summons telling us when the hearing is and giving a preliminary opinion of the European Patent Office. Having reviewed that, a date will be, have, have been set for the final submissions and you really need to make sure that you get all your final arguments in and particularly additional documents and particularly um, if you're the proprietor any fallback sets of patent claims before that date because after that date it can be much more difficult to have additional uh, requests put in or additional documents. Now I've seen many times that additional documents and additional requests are not actually put in until the day of the hearing but nevertheless there's a risk and unless you need to take that risk, unless you've got some really substantial strategic um, view as to why that might be better, and I think it's a little bit equivocal as to whether playing those sorts of tactics is actually really worthwhile or not, then you should actually put in your full final case. And you would normally actually put this in literally on the actual final day when you can, because of course if as the opponent or proprietor you preempt that date, then it will give the other side an opportunity to review your final arguments, think over them and maybe give a rebuttal to some of those points, a rebuttal which may include further documents that they would not otherwise have submitted. So you've now got the final submissions and maybe a week after putting those final submissions in you will see whether the other party has also put some final submissions in and you're now in the final run-up to, um, to the hearing. You may be one, two months away from that final hearing. So the next video we'll be thinking about preparing for that final hearing. Thank you very much.